Well, I got my basket and I'm at Savers. I'm going to do a quick walk through and see what they got. See what I can put in my basket. Oh, look. Those are beautiful couches. Look. Did you just sell those? Those are beautiful. Oh my God. Look. Wow, those are really nice couches. Somebody just bought really nice couches. See, you've got to get here. You've got to get here. You snooze, you lose. Look at those couches. Oh, I love them. Wow, great. I'm sure they were a great deal too. Let's see what they got. I'm looking for porcelain today or look at this guy. Look at this poor guy. <laughs> he's, he's missing his front legs. I bet that's nice too. That looks like a sand cast. I can't read the name, but oh look, look, they love doing that. They love covering up the Sandcast, I was right. Those are nice, those are valuable. I mean, they are if, if, if the legs aren't broken. See what else they got. I love these dogs. $2.99, I love these dogs. Those are little Dalmatians. It looks like his nose is, that I don't like. And look, look at all these dogs, they're so cute, but they're all in really bad condition. Otherwise, I would I would grab those. What is this? I can't really say. That's, they want ten dollars for that. That's no good. I'm looking for something to like art glass or majolica pottery, and it's very rare to find those things at Savers. But every once in a while, you do. This is all, looks also like sand cast, but that's only $4.99. Look, he's so cute. I think, I think I'm gonna take him, you know, cause I've got paints at home, watercolors, I can fix that. You'll never notice it. So he goes in the basket. You stay there now, stay. Oh, look at that face. I gotta leave you behind, buddy, all right? I'm sorry. Your owner should have taken better care of you. Let's see what they got. What do they got, they got hidden behind here? What do they got hidden behind here? Salt, oh, piggy bank, okay. Let's see. Oh, look at this little thing on an amethyst. Is it crystal or amethyst? $2.99. I didn't even check the front to see what's off or half price today. But that's really cute. Look, the tag came off. I'll put that right there. If it's half off, I'll take it. Because I really don't have one of these and I really like them. So let me just put that in the... Don't you think that's beautiful? Look. Those are all... Um... The tag keeps coming off. Let me put that in the basket and get the tag. Because we certainly don't want that to fall off, right? All right. What else? What else do they have here? What's this? Look, there's a mermaid. There's a mermaid on the book. I love that. And it's heavy too. That is so beautiful. $6.99. But look, that's, that is really nice. That's um for pictures. Look what I'm finding. Look at that, isn't that beautiful? You go in there with the dog. I love it. I love it. What else? And what do we have here? That's um, Japan. Two ninety nine. I'll pass. But what is this? 
What is this? $2.99. Uh-oh. Hand-painted. I can't read what the letters are there. There's, um, it's an anchor. I'm sure you know what that means. That's beautiful. Is it broken? Is it broken? Is there a chip? Wow, it looks like it's all there. That's suppo supposed to be like that. That's a beautiful trinket dish. Oh my gosh, I wasn't even going to come today. I was thinking, gosh, I better go before they close. I need, I need merchandise. eBay reselling. Look at this. Look at this trinket box. Look at box. Whoa. Oh my gosh. I just did a video at Goat Feathers out in Boulder City, the antique mall with a whole booth of trinket dishes, trinket boxes. I love this one. Look, it's a... Gotta make sure nothing's broken because everything at Savers and Goodwill and Salvation Army always has chips, cracks. Look. Look at that, that's so cute. Coming with me, buddy. You're coming with me. It's a reindeer. <gasps> I love it. I love it, I'm just on the first row. Look, I'm just on the first row. Never in my life have I seen such good stuff at these stores. I have other videos with some good stuff, but not, not this much good stuff in one on one row. I mean, I'm really hitting it hard. I'm scoring big time, baby. This is pretty. That's pottery, glazed pottery. Unfortunately, there's no price tag on it, but it's pretty. I'm going to let that go. Look at the shell. These can be uh, 15 to $20 um, on eBay. I have a collection of these conch shells. They're really, really nice. But I don't think I need another one. I get them at yard sales and stuff sometimes. They, they don't value them very much. You can get them for a dollar. I've never tried to resell one on eBay, though. What's this? What's this? This looks, um, I don't know, Italy? There's nothing written on the back, and it's cracked, but that's a pretty bowl. What's this? This is cute, but not for $3.99. I still have to go to the front and see what's off today. Cecilia. Ooh, that's interesting. Cecilia. Certificato di qualità. This artifact is curved and decorated entirely by hand. Every imperfection or diversity characterizes the uniqueness of each piece made in Sicily. That's cute. I like it. Look at my stuff, look at my stuff. Oh my gosh, what's this down here? This. Oh my gosh, look at this old serving, look at this old wood serving platter, serving tray. That is really nice. Ireland for Shannon, duty free airport, $6.99. Somebody donated some, look at the handles, this is really old. That's hand carved there. Look, I really like that tray. Oh, I think I'll, I don't think I'm going to pass that one up. Let me put that in my basket. I'm scoring big time. I can't believe it. I don't usually come that often to Savers anymore for the simple reason that there's nothing ever on the shelves. Look at this boat in the bottle. It's $2.99. Look at this boat in the bottle. I love it. Do you have any idea how they get that in there? I have 
have one of those in my swap meet video too. But I don't even, I actually don't own one of these. Oh my God, I love what I'm getting right now. I love what I'm getting right now. Campbell's $3.99 Matchbox. Campbell's Matchbox truck. That is super cool. Have you ever seen one of those before? <gasps> Have you ever seen one of those before? Look at that. That's adorable. Look, New Jersey soup. I love it. I don't really collect Matchbox F350. Cute. It doesn't have the plastic, you know, case over the top. I wonder if that's valuable. Look, it's dirty. Like they were hauling something. <laughs> you know what I mean? It looks like they actually used this truck. It's adorable. I'm sorry to have to say, but I don't want to leave that here. You know what I mean? Some things are just too cute to pass up. Let's see what else they have. Excuse me, there's vases. Be careful because there might be something really good here. I mean, you know, not today, but sometimes. Do you ever find any art glass at Savers or Goodwill? I mean, one time I have a video where I show I got some really nice tall bud vases that art glass, swirly art glass, but really in general do you ever find anything good at these stores it's really hit and miss don't you think it's really hit and miss look at that poor guy that's a planter and planters are desirable they're vintage these planters they want 6.99 for a beat up well it's really not that beat up it's just not nice enough for 6.99 look at these beautiful candle holders there um, like a peacock, the colors of a peacock. Aren't those beautiful? And they're in, well, I was going to say they're in really good condition, but not so much. I say nay, nay, no, no. Unfortunate. I would have purchased these because they're real pretty. But you got to look. When you're at Savers and Goodwill and Salvation Army and any thrift store, You've got to turn things upside down and around and around because you will find the chip in the crack. I do. Most of the time I do. Look at these pretty plates and, and cups. Oh, false graph. False graph. Berry Garland pattern. Lifetime brands made in China. Volksgraf was German. Okay, so they started making their stuff in China. I don't know when, but I'm going to pass. This is Japanese. This is beautiful. Beautiful plate for $1.49. I always calm down and become very peaceful when I see a piece of Japanese artwork. And for that reason, since there's no chips on this, it's really pretty. And it's cheap. I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. Oh, I love my stuff. I love all my stuff. Look. Look. Look what I got. Oh, I got such great stuff. And look, the truck. The truck. Campbell's. I don't know what I'm going to do with that, but I love it. Look at this potato. Look at this potato. They want $5.99 for this covered dish potato. Can you believe it? I don't believe what I'm seeing. I've never seen anything like this. Have you? Have you ever seen a russet potato? Shaped um, terrain? Oh my gosh. That is amazing. I can't believe what I just found, but I'm not going to get it. Look at the birds on here. Look, look at the birds on, on this. It's cute. Let me, there's a brand on the bottom. I hope it's not China. It is. It's Teleflora. Do you know what? 
Look up Teleflora. I was surprised when I looked up Teleflora that some of their um, their porcelain and ceramic stuff and glass is expensive. I was really surprised to find that out. I just don't have time right now since I'm doing like a 30 minute sweep at the end of the day. Um, I don't have the time to look it up and I might be passing up something really good. You tell me. What's this? That's super cool. That's for like a cappuccino or something. Or a latte. Those are. That's a beautiful uh, cup and cup holder. Is that aluminum or... Those are really nice. That looks like it comes from a restaurant. I wouldn't even know how to look that up. It's nice, but I'm going to pass. It's a nay, nay, no, no for me. If it doesn't have a brand on it or I really don't want to take the time to look up something um, for the brand, I'll just pass on it because it's just too much work, you know what I mean, if you're going to resell. I like stuff with stamps on it. Here's Kentucky Derby. I don't know if these are valuable or not, but these are from the Kentucky Derby, and it's $2.99, and there's three of them. So what do you say? Triple crown winners. Philly, 129, Kentucky Derby, 129. And it's got all the, um, all the years, up to 2003 with a question mark next to it. That's so cool. Let's take those. I think anything with Kentucky Derby is good. I think, but I'm not sure. I like taking a minute to look at the pictures, the paintings, because every once in a while you find some really good stuff like I just found. But look, this is a drawing. Harley Davidson. Harley Davidson's pretty popular. It's $5.99. Somebody drew this. Interesting. And they put it in a schlocky frame, but it's still really nice. And look at this great thing. And it's signed by the artist Luis Grohl, G-R-O-L. That might be good too. It's not sitting in there properly. We have to open it and, and move it back. It's really old. But it's a nice drawing or painting or whatever it is. And it's only $2.99. And that is really cool. I can't tell what that is. I can't tell what type of artwork that is, but it's really cheap. It's a really nice cat. And here's something hand painted by Cece. It's a real pretty little, a real pretty little picture. This is really nice. It's storks. I don't know what it's made of. It looks like little shells for the tree trunk. There's little tiny shells. And the stork is also little tiny shells. Um, and then they're on the beach. This is Japanese. There's a stamp on the corner of it. It's really, really nice. And for that reason, I don't know what the pine tree is made out of. Is that if that's real pine? I don't know what that is. But it's beautiful and it's it's old. I'm gonna grab that too. Very nice. Here's something really pretty. I don't know what this is, if it's a print or it's it's signed, but it's so small I can't see it. I can't see what it says, but I really like it. Spring in somewhere, but that's beautiful. Look at that gorgeous scene. I love it. Look at that. I think I'm going to grab this one too. Put that one in my basket. Look at this beautiful picture that nobody bought. This
This is a painting. Look at this, and somebody took the time to put these corners on there, and it's not signed. It's $9.99. Look how it's framed. It's great. That is so pretty. I love that. Look at those little lovebirds. I'm going to take it. I'm going to take that with me. Look at that. Is that um, paint or is that that's beautiful? Oh, it's signed 2018. I can't read the name, but it's beautiful. Look at that picture. Okay, let's go. You've got to grab and go. When you're at these stores and you and you score. And you keep scoring like this. You just got to put it all in your cart. You got to put it all in your cart. Because if you don't, if you don't, somebody else will. Always remember that if you see it and you like it and you have to have it or you think you can flip it, grab it. That's pretty, that cobalt blue. It's nice. Made in China. Here's a really nice, um, it's number 150 out of 250. Phoenix Country Club Internet Invitational 1983, Roger Whitney. Look at that, that that's beautiful. It's $4.99, $4.99 for a golfer? On eBay? Are you kidding me? Grab it, Gail. Like I said, grab and go, baby. It's in mint condition. When you see stuff like this, and it's $4.99 at Savers, and it's a, a print like this, or whatever it is, a lithograph of the Phoenix Country Club Invitational from 1983, and you can read the name, Roger Whitney, and the number, you need to buy it. Because there are lots of golfers who would love this. Look, Roger Whitney, Southwest artist, golf classic, American Airlines, look. This is amazing. It tells all about the artist from 1983 and it's 2021 now. So this comes home with me. Oh my gosh, I can't believe what I just found. I cannot believe what I just found. What is this? A piece of Americana, look, for $6.99. It's a, it's a flag, it's an American flag. Somebody made this. It's pretty. It's Americana. It would probably sell on eBay, but I don't want to ship it, so I'm going to I'm going to pass right now because I really like the pictures that I got. The place is packed today. I had no idea. I just took a chance. Look. Oh my god, it's heavy. How much do they want for this? I bet I bet people need this kind of thing. I don't see a price. Look at that. What do you call that? I'm sure you know. You haul stuff with that. That is heavy duty. Let's see what else they have and then I'm going to say, well, you know what I'm going to say. Thanks so much for watching and see you next time, right? Give me a couple more minutes. Yes, I love these. Made in Italy. Bingo. $1.99. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Should I buy this? I love this. I love this. I love stuff made in Italy. What, what would you do? Would you buy this? It's a dollar ninety-nine. It could be half off today. I don't know. It goes on the wall. All right. Well, I'm going to think about it. And while I'm thinking about it, I'm going to say thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. And bye. 
to know which, which is your favorite thing here. Would, would you buy this or would you put this back? Really? What do you think is really going to flip on eBay in here? You tell me, what's your favorite piece? I don't know, I'm, I got a toss up between the mermaid and the trinket dish. I have a feeling that's pretty good. I'm gonna grab this. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.